whether we had to give you a hint. Mm -hmm. Could you please say your name into the microphone, Thomas? <coughs> my name? Mm -hmm. In my language? Any language you want to use? Sure, in your language would be great. I know, I know. Thomas Underwood say And there's the phone call. <laughs> Let's take that thing off your We're going in the stereo. Yeah. Um, could you start by saying the word for deer? You see. One more time. You see. Every word we're going to ask you, if you would, to say two times into the song. Um, the next word is the word for that little bug that hides in a hole. I didn't forget. Lolo. Lolo. Again. Lolo. Saying that again, Hachin Lolo. Hachin Lolo. One more time. Hachin Lolo. Okay. And then we, mm -hmm. we talked about um, that kind of. Hey, you two, you've got to be quieter. Yeah, Catherine, Ben. Catherine, you've got to be a little quieter, okay? <laughs> I'm sorry. Um, we talked about that kind of uh, bee. Um, that Catherine remembers the word for from a long time ago. Hati Mimi. Do you remember that one? A what? It's some kind of a bee. Bumblebee, Catherine says. Hati Mimi. Would you say the word, Catherine, please? Hati Mimi. Hati Mimi. Hati Mimi. You know that word, Thomas? No. Okay. Well, we'll skip that one. Um, do you know the word for a kind of lizard called halambo? Halambo. Halambo. Okay. And um, how would you say um, somebody went blind? Shamba. Yamuga no shamba tuk. Would you just say the shamba part? Shamba. Shamba. Perfect. Um, could you say the word for tree? Iti. Again, please. Iti. And how about post oak? Chisha. Again, please. Chisha. And how about the word for mulberry? Oh, be hit, yeah. And could you say that one again? <coughs> be hit. And um, how about the word for poke salad? I don't know then. Catherine, could you please say poke salad? Koshiba. Koshiba. Okay, one more time. Koshiba. Perfect. And then I know we had trouble last week with the word for pine tree. Mm -hmm. That was the one we went round and round about. <laughs> yeah. Um, a lot of people say tea. Tehak. Tehak. One more time. Tehak. Um. And how about the word for road? Hina. Again, please. Hina. And the word for barn? Pecha. One more time. Pecha. And the word for pillow? Pillow. Oh, spishy. One more time. Spishy. One more time, can I hear that? Spishy. And um, could you say the word for foot? 
Iye. Iye. And how about the word for mouth? Hiti. One more time. Hiti. And the word for lips? Somebody's lips? Oh, tell me. One more time. He tell me. And the word for nose? Bitchela. Bichela. And how would you say somebody's got a cold? Yamogano, Abishano. Can you just say that, Abishano? Abishano. Abishano. One more time. Abishano. Okay. And could you say the word for um, an animal's tail? Waka. Waka. Hasimbish. One more time. Hasimbish. Okay. And um, what's the word for yes? Yes. Somebody says something and you say yes back to them. E. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. To glue. Okay. To glue. Okay. And how do you say it's raining? Umba. Again, please. Umba. How would you say he's eating? What? He's eating. Impa. Oh. Impa. One more time. Impa. And how would you say somebody's buying something? <coughs> Nanchumba. Could you just say chumpa? Chumpa. One more time. Chumpa. And how would you say he's sick? Maybe that guy over there. He's sick. <laughs> Aveka. He doesn't look sick. Aveka. Aveka. Okay. How would you say I am sick? His skin? No. Um, I'm sick. Oh. Asavika. One more time. Asavika. Aveke chili. One more time. Aveke chili. Okay, and how about I made you sick? It's not going to be a TV chili. One more time. It's not going to be a TV costly. And could you say that one more time, please? It's not going to be a TV costly. Isabe Kati. Okay, one more time. Isabe Kati. And um, if you want to say about somebody, um, their kid is sick, you could say Chipota Imambika. Mm -hmm. Could you just say that Imambika word? <coughs> Imambika. One more time. Imambika. Washing me. He's not he's watching me, but he's washing me. He's got soap and a towel and everything. Oh. Sachi Vati. And can you say um uh something like a Sachifa? Sashiva. One more time? Sashiva. Asachifa. Great. Could you say that one again? Asachifa. How would you say, um, we wash him? No, once again, we're back to washing, not watching. We wash oh. him. Ilachifa. Achifa. Um, we are washing him. All of us together, we're getting together and we're going to, we're going to all give him a bath. Oh. I think it'll be something like Ila Chifa. Pushnogon Ila Chifa. Okay, could you say that Ila Chifa one more time? Ma Chifa. Mm, I want to hear Ila Chifa. Mm -hmm. Could you say that one? Ila Chifa. Perfect. And then 
when, when something is washed, um, the word meaning it's already washed is something like aschifa. Aschifa. Could you just say aschifa? Aschifa. One more time, please. Aschifa. 